All right, so hey guys, Ryan Moore here at Pure Vita Fitness. I'm doing your April group template today, explaining the purpose of it. I know a lot of the last few months I've been giving you a description online on a newsletter or however you are getting it. So now I wanna give you that option, but sometimes it's not the easiest to understand what I'm saying throughout those. So I'm going to talk each month now online with a video real quick to explain the purpose of the workout. Uh, if you have questions, catch me here in the gym or just ask uh, someone around and they should typically know my purpose. So this is April, we're closer to summer. So I've put a lot more high rep um, cardio and dynamic movements into this workout because we're already getting closer to summer. So we are trying to lean out, most of us at least, and try to look good for being outside in warm weather. So the way it works, when you see your template, I'm gonna put it to you in the most broken down way possible today. The number one thing we want to do, no matter whether it's a group setting or a one-on-one -on -one setting, is first of all, do our warm-up that we have been taught. It is always up here. If you don't understand or have not been taught it yet, please ask and have someone do that for you. Um, I'm going to also be adding the muscle-specific warm-up, meaning upper body or lower body for that day. If it's a full body day, talk to your trainer about how to compromise the two so you're not spending a ton of time doing it. But once you have it down, it's really not that hard to do or that is not that time consuming to do, okay? So we have our warm up, our glute activation, which again, most of us should know our glute activation with the mini bands. We've been doing a lot of the hip thrust, single leg hip thrust, clam shells, fire hydrants, so forth. Make sure we're doing those. Number one, they're gonna save your back. Number two, you're gonna get a lot more out of your workout from it as well, okay? So warm up to make sure our body's warmed up, healthy, ready to go, glute activation, kind of the same thing, but it's gonna save a lot more of our back and it's gonna give us a lot more to produce muscle um, recruitment in our workouts so we're getting more out of our workouts. All right, moving on, the jumps and the slams, if you're wondering why those are in there, it is to get your central nervous system activated, get a little bit more dynamic movement in your joints and ligaments so you got blood flow to those areas. When you're going into heavier lifts, you have much more fluidity fluidity in your muscles and ligaments and tendons. You're not super stiff going into a squat or whatever it may be. Um, so again, those are in there for that purpose. Uh, number three, the dynamic and cardio mix we have this month. So you got the push presses, things like that, where you're moving weight at a more dynamic or explosive format. It's gonna get your heart rate up. It's gonna get your nervous system activated more coming out of the jumps and the slams. And it's gonna cause you to do something different with your body, which means the theory of accommodation is what we call it in this field. It's gonna keep you from plateauing from what you've done in the past, which is just stagnant lifts. We're doing a set count of bench press or squat or something that's more stationary. So now we're getting a lot more out of our body by doing something more challenging, something more explosive and so forth, okay? So you're gonna have your dynamic movement plus timed cardio, whatever that may be, that's up to your trainer of the day. So you're gonna do something, go right away into cardio, come back. Again, we're trying to keep that heart rate elevated so we continue to burn body fat and use our metabolism. Lastly, the AMRAP time circuits, as many rounds as possible is what that means. Um, time slowly increases because again, that theory of accommodation or otherwise known as preventing plateaus, we're trying to always challenge ourselves and then the circuits, the point of what is in the circuit also has a point. Everything I do has a point. We're working on our mobility with things like inchworms. We're working on keeping our heart rate up, which is pretty obvious because you're doing as many rounds as possible. So you're nonstop moving, ideally. And then we're working smaller muscle groups because now we're done with the big lifts. We're coming down into more of the aesthetics and things like that. And also those smaller muscle groups that we make, when we work on those, they help our bigger lifts also get better. So again, a lot of information coming at you at once. I just wanna hope you understand it more easily than reading on a piece of paper. Again, if you have questions, email us, uh, talk to me in the gym or someone in the gym, but please understand that we're gonna to try to make this as understandable as possible for you going forward so you know exactly why we're asking you to do what we're asking you to do. And then remember, we always have alterations. If you're not ready for certain things, we can always alter for you. All right, guys, thanks a lot. This is Ryan coming to you from Pure Vita Fitness.